Cyberspace. Falconetti Circus. Gigabyte virtual environment. <laughs> Made it myself. Pretty impressive, huh? Think of it like a game room, and you're my favorite toy. <laughs> you're called the Answer Doll, and the idea is I throw a knife, and you answer a question. Who? The. Kiss my ass. You want to talk to me? You get me down from here. An ass kissing? That's a pretty high order. <laughs> Not a smart move for somebody in your position. You got your bald, buddy. Ah! <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> this has nothing to do with you. I have a friend who was attacked by the Ripper. The Ripper? Someone who's almost as good with knives as I am. She needs your help. Before I help you, you gotta show me what you're worth in cyberspace. I'm gonna work with you, I gotta know you can handle yourself. What are you gonna do, give me a test? I'm gonna run you through cores, see how you shoot. If you shoot a bad guy, you get a point. If you shoot a good guy, you lose. My score was pretty damn high. Beat it and we'll talk. Oh, fuck!
Christ! I feel like a fucking corpse! Lucky for you, I had to come up for air. Hey, Twig, you lazy piece of shit! What kind of cheap-ass nootropics you feed me? I can barely keep up with the data transfer in there. No wonder I lost that fucking contest. All right, hotshot. What do you want? What's your take on the Ripper, Eddie? Holy shit, I just realized you're the one he writes to. He's the only reason to read the rags. Fucking guy's incredible. He gets in there, paints the room in blood like Jackson Pollock on crack, and gets out without a trace. And that's buzzing about this psycho. You sound like his number one fan. I can't get the guy out of my head. His stealth, his tools. I've been collecting knives for 30 years. I don't have a clue what kind of blade he's using. What's with all these knives? Well, for one, I'd say they're sharp. I didn't mean that. Oh, I see. I collect knives, and there's a serial killer loose. Knives equal killer, right? Gee, I heard you reporter types were smart, but heck, you're way over my head here. Okay. There's this detective named Magnata working the case. Won't tell me much. You say Magnata? Christ. <laughs> He's worse than fucking criminals. Sounds like you know him. Know him? I know him. I know I'd like to blow his fucking brains out. Well. How did an outlaw like you hook up with a respected doctor like Burton? You mean she didn't tell you? Baby has the hearts for me. Has for years. <laughs> Does she? My friend and partner was attacked by the Ripper. If you're going through all this for a woman, I assume you're doing her. Do crazy shit for love, don't we? Yeah. I'm beginning to think so. Look, Eddie, why don't you help me out with Catherine? Why should I risk my ass for you? You could get in on the Ripper case. I'm interested in the Ripper, not your girlfriend. You can save a Ripper victim. I mean, think of the publicity. What do you want with publicity? I'm a fucking outlaw. You could piss off your old enemy, Magnata. Uh, here's the deal. I've been in cyberspace for 80 hours. I gotta collect from two bookies, eat a big steak, because I'm dying for some real food, and sweat these cheap ass nootropics out of my system. It'll take a couple hours. I'll meet you at the ICU later. Then we'll see what a genius can do about your babe. Great, I'll see you there. <laughs> 